Peter Downing, what struck me really about this story, apart from his courage, giving his life um, to helping others in, you know, such terrible danger, is that your uncle, Bruce Dowding, never got the recognition he deserved. France actually wanted to give him its highest honour for bravery, but it was never awarded. Tell us why. Well, the, the French government wrote to the Australian government and the Australian government uh, discovered that he was not an Australian member of the Australian services, uh, although someone in the Prime Minister's department identified who he was and where his family was, but they never communicated to the family the French offer and they simply wrote back to the French uh, government saying, well, he wasn't an Australian, so uh, don't worry, don't bother us about it. That's just so sad. We, we, we have a habit at the moment of when we're looking at, to, at people who have been honoured, you know, to tear down statues, to this, that, to, you know, uh, pour rubbish over our past. Why do you think it's important to honour people like uh, your uncle? Well, look, the purpose of the book's not really about getting an honour for him, but there were a lot of very brave people uh, who haven't been honoured in wars. And we would like to make the point that these people need to be recognised and they do need to be accepted as part of the heroes of our community. We, we, in that context, we'd very much like Bruce to be recognised. In fact, we, we put an application into the Australian Honours and award secretariat saying, well, if you can't give, if he can't get his quite a year, maybe you could give him an Australian Hero Award. But, but we haven't ever had a positive response about it. I just think we need to recognise um, it's not always the super heroes who are the important ones, but, but it's the ordinary men and women who do fantastically brave things we should recognise. Absolutely. Peter Dowding, the book is terrific. Great story. One of those inspirational ones about Australia, the kind of people that uh, do us proud. Thank you so much for writing the book. Thank you for coming on the show. Well, thank you. And I've, I've left one here for you, Andrew, with an endorsement. I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> uh, former Labor Premier, I don't know that you should be doing that, but thank you so much anyway. <laughs> <laughs> thank you.